Welcome to Echo Lake, nestled in the Capel Valley in Fort Capel, Saskatchewan. Once this was a Hudson Bay Company trading post, today it is an idyllic prairie town and host of the Fort Winter Festival. Also known as everything you'd ever want to do on a frozen lake, but you were afraid of being arrested. The man is Vince Crawford. The sport is motorcycle ice racing, correct? Correct. Why don't you, like, just put your motorcycle away when the ice and the snow comes and, I don't know, use the snowmobile or something? There's no snow. That's a good point, actually. I never thought about that. <laughs> you just got to race on the ice. Yeah, so is it? Uh, how fast do you go? On this track, we're hitting 80 to 85 miles per hour. Let's talk about the pure sport of motorcycle ice racing. How did you get involved? I actually got tricked by a guy doing motocross and said, you shouldn't put your bike away for the winter. You should come out and ride with us. Right. That was it. Just make Saskatchewan winter more enjoyable. And no one wants to put their bike away, do they? Sure don't. That's a sad yeah, time when you have to put day. your bike away. <laughs> what do you actually call these tires? Just studded? Studded tires. Because that doesn't seem to do enough. They're all season radials if one of your seasons is danger. So you're good at the wheelies? I'm pretty good at wheelies. Seem pretty good at the wheelies? Can we, like, put together a wheelie competition between the two of you? Yeah, yeah. for sure. Yeah? yeah? Young versus old. No, sorry, young versus, like, slightly more experienced. <laughs> yeah. Right? There are no rules. Just be super cool. I feel like I have to end this before something terrible happens. Because I have no idea what an orange flag means. It could mean hit me for all I know. Look at that! Oh, there is a prize. It's an official Mercer Report crew t-shirt. It's the only one I had with me. And um, I'd say it's a three-way tie, except I think you're the only one who'd fit into it. There we go. Now we got it. Sponsor's name on the athlete. One of the big attractions here at the festival is the drift racing. This is Austin Phillips. He is a local legend. Hello, Austin. How are you? Hello, Rick. Good to see you. Drift racing. What is it? Uh, lots of going sideways, lots of speed. It's uh, just a lot of fun and a big adrenaline rush. And you are a local legend. You have your own trailer, I see, <laughs> oh, which is awesome. <laughs> Slightly better than yeah. show business because yours is heated. Yeah. Drop dead drift. What's that? other than a cool sticker. <laughs> it's our uh, not-for-profit organization. Really? So you guys are, like, raising money for charity? Yes. It's the future. I think we should get in it. You should give me a lesson, and then we should race. All right, let's do it. Excuse me while I drift off. No, no, no. Before we go, do we put our seatbelt on? No. We're on ice, we don't want to fall. Right, we are on a lake. Right. In fact, I am covered because we are driving on a lake, and I have a driver's license, and a boat smart card. <laughs> Whatever happens, Your Honor, I am covered. There we go. No, no counter steer. Oh. Now we're doing donuts. Uh. These are just donuts. <laughs> <laughs> they don't teach you this in young drivers, and they should. OK, how are we doing? Yeah, perfect. Hold too much. Ah! Uh-oh, I don't want to hit him. Sorry. Jeez. I Stop. I'm not doing this on purpose, I swear. That was wise. There you go. Hey! How are ya? I look like every driver in Toronto after this one centimeter of snow. <laughs> They're on the 401, like, I don't know what to do! I don't know what to do! I have to get to work! Hey, hi there, sorry! Didn't mean to cut you off in traffic there. Put my signal light on. Oh, yeah, tinka, yeah. tinka, tinka, tinka. Yeah. Excuse me, you gotta put your nose in traffic. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> I hope there's no one in there. And if there is, I hope it was Brad Wall. Okay, 
am now joined by Becky Hill. Hello, Becky Hill. Hi, Rick. I am here at the Polar Bear Dip, correct? You are correct. And you have a clipboard, so I'm guessing you're in charge. I'm important. What are we raising money for? Uh, today we're raising money for the Children's Hospital of Saskatchewan, the yes. Heart Stroke Foundation, and our own local hospital here in Fort Capel. I tell you, I was very excited to watch this event, and then some guy said he would give $100 to Heart and Stroke if I jumped in the water. Oh. <laughs> and of course, I leapt at the opportunity. It's on, Rick. Because it's not like I felt obligated or anything. No. 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 And so, you know, here we are. Here we are. Enjoying Canada. <laughs> Do I get a survival suit and a rope? No, sir. I think we have the first jumper. What's your name? Nikita. Nikita. Good luck, Nikita. Oh! What's your name? Alex. Alex, this is all for a wonderful cause, isn't it? I hope so. Do you have any technique or strategy planned? Cannonball. Oh, good job. <laughs> this is happening. Money for the heart and stroke. I think I had a heart attack on a stroke. <laughs> Happy winter! <laughs> <laughs>